Hello YouTube! In today's video we'll be talking about one of the most annoying things that can happen to spear fisherman or freediver. We will also show you a simple cheap solution that Navy used that will prevent this thing from happening in the first place. Swimmer's ear, also medically known as otitis externa, is bacterial infection of the ear canal. We will not be going into details, but this happens because when we dive there is always some water pressure which spreads our ear canal skin, allowing water and bacteria to form perfect environment for infection. It usually happens when you do multiple days of diving and you'll usually feel symptoms when you wake up the next morning. The first mild symptoms you might experience are your ear feeling full or slight discomfort and tenderness when chewing the food. The escalating symptoms are sharp pain in the ear canal, redness and swelling. You might also experience some kind of discharge and at that point you should get checked by the doctor so he can prescribe you the right treatment. People usually don't take this kind of infections seriously but the fact is if you leave a bad case of swimmer's ear untreated it can spread to the nearby tissue or even to the skull. If you already have symptoms, you probably won't be able to equalize pressure anyway and you should avoid diving until you fully treat your ear. Now let's talk about prevention part. The Navy actually studied this back in the 40s when they started saturation diving. About 20% of those dives would result in swimmer's ear infections so they developed otic acid solution which was poured in divers ears for about 5 minutes prior to diving and it fully solved the problem. Unfortunately, you require prescription for otic solution plus it's pretty expensive so we'll show you how to make a similar mixture yourself. You will need distilled white vinegar, 70% isopropyl alcohol and 99% glycerin. The ratio for this solution is 45% vinegar, 45% alcohol and 10% glycerin. The best container to store the mixture is glue bottle applicator or something similar which has the spoot for drops. You should fill each ear canal with your head tilted and wait a few minutes so the mixture gets absorbed prior to diving. You can also use the mixture after the diving to maximize its effect. That's all for today's swimmer's ear prevention video. Tell us if you found this helpful in the comments below. If you like spear fishing and free diving, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on our future content. Thanks for watching and stay safe while diving.